Chuck, the city of Peoria has continued to declare a local state of emergency for COVID-19 since the start of the pandemic. That's as surrounding counties decide to take a different approach. John Schoenheider in studio to explain how it works and when the city plans to call it off, John. Yeah, Tyler, good evening. An agenda item for tomorrow night's city council meeting includes the signing of this, a declaration of local state of emergency for COVID-19. It's the same one that the mayor has signed since March of 2020, outlining orders that the city can enforce on how business is conducted in Peoria. City manager Patrick Urich says the city plans to maintain the state of emergency for the same time as the state and federal governments. While in place, city boards and commissions can work in a virtual or hybrid setting. The city can also enforce COVID-19 protocols for their facilities, but it's becoming increasingly uncommon. According to their agendas, neither Bloomington or Pekin indicate extending emergency declarations at their city council meetings. Beyond the safety regulations, the declaration allows local governments to collect funding to help cover extra costs. If you could or, uh, account for all those that spending, then you could turn that in and get reimbursed from the state or the feds for those. Tesla County Board Chairman David Zimmerman says the county received $27 million total to help cover various expenses. The county declared their own emergencies until the end of 2021, which received little pushback from residents. Zimmerman adds as hospitalizations remain low for COVID-19. Peoria City Manager Patrick Yurick says the city has not received any additional money outside of the designated funding from CARES and American Rescue Act funds. Now, we did reach out to multiple county health departments in our area today, board and even the governor's office for more information on whether or not these trends are common across Illinois today. We're waiting to hear back from many of them. Tomorrow night's Peoria City Council meeting, Tyler, starts at 6 in the evening.